Hey guys, Mark Rosetto here. I've got Russ, Russ hey, Jadson. Hey, how you doing? Newborn photographer extraordinaire. Where yeah. from from where are you from? From London. I'm originally from South Africa, but I've been in I've been in the UK for about 17 years now, 18 years, so I can hear that twang. Yeah, all of a sudden. Now they, now, get, they, now, 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 yeah. now you've said it. I get Aussie all the time, which says a South African's not a good thing, but yeah, no, <laughs> South, South African British, South African British, that's what I am. That's cool. How long have you been doing newborns for? Uh, I started newborns in around about 2010, so going on nine years now. So, what is it that you love the most? Oh, the, the idea that I, well, the fact that I can work from Monday to Friday, uh, that for me is probably the big winner with newborns. I mean, they are hard work, yes, of course they are, but I can work Monday to Friday, I can get to spend quality time with my kids, with my family, and uh, yeah, that's a winner for me. So it's, it's kind of like a lifestyle Absolutely. choice as well. I mean, look, I, I love photographing them, I think... Um, the emotions that I see with my clients when they see their pictures, it just gives me a hell of a lot of sort of sense of, of reward and fulfillment. Yeah. But yeah, it definitely is a lifestyle choice as well. Um, being able to work Monday to Friday, spend quality time with my family is, is a big winner. Cool. And still manage to sort of, you know, run a successful business. Cool. How did you feel doing your first newborn shoot so many years oh, ago? Oh, man. How well, was that wrapping in that oh, kudo? I was, I was one of those that looked at it. Uh, you know, I was an experienced portrait photographer before I started doing it. And, yeah. Uh, I first saw these newborn images and thought, oh, well, how hard can that be? You know, pop a baby down on the it be? pictures, de easy peasy. So it was a little bit of a baptism of fire. I remember that first first uh, session I did. It was actually a, a, a free session that I was doing for one of my clients just to sort of try and build up a portfolio. Yep. And I just remember looking at my, my pictures and, and just thinking, oh, my goodness. Got a long well, way to yeah, go. Yeah, a long way to go. How long, how, how, how long was it? How many years was it from that shot to like, you know what, I've got this. I can do this now. I'm feeling pretty confident. Well, it's a good question. I, I'm so amazed these days. I, I get uh, photographers that come in for training that have been doing it for two years, and they already are so far ahead of what I was after four. Yeah. Um, you know, it took me a long time. I, I mean, I still look at my images and think I can improve them. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, I, I think now today with all the training that is available, it's just amazing for new people coming into newborn photography. Yeah. But yeah, I would say a pro probably a good three and a half to four years before I looked at my images and and looked at them with any sense of pride in the sense that I was really happy with what I was producing. Cool. Two um, last questions. Yeah. Education, tell me quick about that, and I want you to put your education links in the comments. Oh, okay. When you, yeah. After, so, obviously not now. So we've <laughs> just started our education channel. It's brand new. It's called rustjacksonacademy.com. Yep. Um, in there we are now starting off with newborn, so we're doing newborn lighting, we're doing newborn posing, there'll be newborn editing coming on in the next few days. Awesome. Uh, and that's going to be as, available as a bundle as well, along with some specific actions that I've made for newborn photoshopping. Cool. Yeah. Last question, the Russ today, mm -hmm. if he went back 10 years ago yeah. and spoke to the Russ when he first started, what piece of advice would you give? I'll oh, get some training. Get some training done as soon as possible. For me, the reason why it took so long to get my images where I wanted them was there was just no training available in the UK at that time. Now there is, there's so many different sources, both in person and online. Get some training with a quality newborn photographer, somebody you really admire, can't go wrong. Yeah, cool. Awesome. Good. Awesome. Very cool. Super. Well, have an awesome day. Thanks Enjoy. See you guys. Bye. Cheers. Thanks very much. Ciao.